I'm just excited to be here actually in teams. Um, you know, the X Games has been such a huge thing in action sports um, in the States and I think it's a great thing that it's being brought to Europe um, and you know, broadening the, the world stage that, that X Games is. Um, and we're, we're part of history in the making right now. I'm ben, uh, super content uh, that the X Games come to Tine. We see tout de suite the puissance of the event. A gros village qui se crée, a pipe uh, parfait, a slop style that commence to être super bien, and all the media that are réunis. It's a chance for us to talk about our sport. It's really bien que ça se passe à Tine, uh, chez moi, dans mon jardin. J'ai de, de, de nouvelles structures pour m'entraîner, c'est top. If anyone who, who doesn't know snowboarding as much, like, oh, Louie, I want to come check out one of your contests, it's always like, come to X Games. I mean, when you come to X Games, it's got the great atmosphere. I mean, you have, like, the mini village going on. You have, um, you know, have this going on here, this going on there. And you can just walk up to it. I mean, there's no tickets. You just go there and watch. You, just, you can just feel it, like, feel the energy. It's all positive. When the event comes, I mean, it's probably, besides the Olympics, the biggest crowd you'll have in, in snowboard or skiing. The amount of people that came to support and watch was amazing. Great, great atmosphere, great crowd. I think it's awesome that the X Games are coming to Europe because it gave me two chances to do well at an X Games. Some of the craziest views I've ever seen and to be skiing a slope style course, I feel kind of bad. I feel like I should be out skiing the real mountain. I think that this was one of the biggest um, things that could have happened for our sport, X Games coming to Europe. Um, you know, all of us want to see ski half pipe in the Olympics in 2014 and the IOC, the International Olympic Committee, really likes to see a large diversity in nationalities in sports and the crowd here was just amazing. Just to prove that Europe can support this um, movement is really encouraging and exciting so I hope that they continue to have this event here and I hope the right people are paying attention. The X Games vibe kind of, the, the, the mood, the, the people but in a different place, uh, on a different mountain, different panoramic view. Uh, it's just nice, I know, it's just, it almost feels like an X Games tour. <laughs> Et puis, euh, ce, qui est, ce qui est surtout intéressant pour nous, c'est que ça va pousser le freestyle euh, en haut de l'affiche. On va, on va parler beaucoup plus de ski freestyle, alors, parce que c'est vrai qu'aux états unis on en parle beaucoup. En France, c'est pas vraiment connu. Donc, euh, bah, c'est l'objectif d'arriver à faire connaître un peu plus notre sport et d'en parler à la télé, dans les magazines. Everybody's so nice and it's just so fun to be out here in France and it's just such a pretty place, such a beautiful place. Yeah, I think it's really awesome that ESPN is bringing this event to Europe. You know, I think there's so many like core skiers out here, like huge skier, pop skier and snowboarder population out here. People are really into this and I think it's awesome that we have one in North America and now one in Europe and who knows, hopefully one day in every continent.